T50 and T25 firmware update. Check out what's new. 1. Task summary is available during operation. You can view completed work data and estimated chemical usage in real time during operations. 2. Enabling low speed ascend allows the drone to start spraying from higher altitude after flying to the breakpoint or start point, reducing the risk of lodging. 3. Empty tank point estimation and automatic RTH are supported during multi-plot operations. After completing multi-plot operations, the drone will automatically return to home, enhancing the convenience of using multitask. 4. Added spray and spread when turning on orchard routes. When enabled, the drone will continue to spray or spread during lateral movements, improving boundary spraying effectiveness. 5. Added show fields nearby function. When planning plots, this feature helps avoid overlapping, making multi-plot planning easier. Activate this in map layer. During manual operations, nearby plot boundaries can be referenced to prevent over or under spraying. 6. Added route visualization function in M plus mode. Aligning the drone's direction and spacing at breakpoints is now more convenient. During flight, you can manually adjust the route according to the guidelines to avoid route deviation and inconsistent spacing. Enable this in settings. 7. Save manual flights for later. After a manual flight or spraying field boundaries, this operation area can be saved as a field with one click for easy use later. 8. Added point and line marking. When planning field flight routes, objects like holes or power lines can be marked to assist pilots in assessing the operating environment. 9. Added emergency stop feature. During flight, pilots can press the orange pause button on the remote controller. This will cause the drone to pause automatic flight and enter hover mode.